This Be More Lifestyle segment is sponsored by Baltimore Magazine. Add some charm to your wedding by having it in Charm City. All right, so joining us now is the editor of Baltimore Weddings, Janelle Diamond. Welcome to the show. Thank you. All right, so what are some wedding trends that you see coming to the Baltimore area? So, you know, Baltimore has really always been kind of anything goes, which is why we love weddings here so much. Um, but particularly post COVID, we're still seeing a lot of these really small, intimate weddings, um, which we really love. We actually do a whole shoot in our current issue mm -hmm. on little white dresses and how that's a big trend right now for brides instead of doing the, the big dress. And there's certainly still a lot of people doing the big dress but the little white dress can be really playful and sexy and lovely. Oh, okay. Now tell us about some of the things that couples are loving right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, you know, again, in Baltimore, our venues are outstanding. So we're really seeing a, like a wide variety of venues. Our cover couple got married um, outside at a park which is so lovely. We have a couple in our current issue who got married at married at Meriwether Post Pavilion. Um, we have cu a couple who got married um, in their family home, which was exquisite, like during a winter storm. Mm -hmm. So we're seeing a lot of personality expressed through all of our amazing local venues. Okay, now we, we saw that there was like a bridesmaid shoot that you did around town. What was the idea behind that? So, you know, I have always thought about the fact that when a bride tells her bridesmaids what the dress is, she, she always usually says, you'll be able to wear it again. You'll be able to wear it again. So we put it to the test. We took three dresses from Bella Bridesmaids, which is a wonderful local uh, bridesmaid shop, and put those dresses in a grocery store, in a pharmacy, you know, at a bar, and tried to show really how bridesmaids can take these dresses that a lot of times they've spent a few hundred dollars on and actually wear them again. And so we had a lot of fun. Lemon and Lime event design really knocked that one out of the park. It's a really fun, playful, but helpful shoot in our current issue. You. Okay. Now, can you give us some details about aisle style wedding shows? What is that about? Yes, our wedding party is back. We're so excited. We obviously were on a little bit of a hiatus because of COVID, but it's back um, March 8th. So a little over a month from now, we'll be at the Winslow on Tuesday, March 8th. It is such an amazing event because it's intimate enough that couples are able to talk to all 40 plus vendors. But there's such a like wonderful variety of vendors that um, you know you really can plan your entire wedding you know just by spending a few hours with us at the wedding party. And I actually have a few things from that are going to be at our show. These gorgeous flowers are Baltimore Blossoms, a local florist. She's going to be there. You'll be able to talk to her. Where can see we go? Where can we go for flowers. more information, Janelle? Like if we want you know tickets or anything, where can we go for more info? Sure, um, you can go to our website, BaltimoreWeds.com. There'll be wedding cakes there we have signature cocktails copper kitchens doing small bites okay. it's gonna be fantastic excellent thank you so much for joining us today thank you guys hope to all see right. you there all right